नमस्कार इंडिया मेटोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट वेलकम यू इन डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग द हीट वेव कंडीशन ओवर नॉर्थ वेस्ट सेंट्रल एंड ईस्ट इंडिया आर लाइकली टू कंटिन्यू ड्यूरिंग नेक्स्ट थ्री डेज इन आइसोलेटेड पॉकेट्स विद रिड्यूस्ड इंटेंसिटी एंड द साउथ वेस्ट मॉनसून इज लाइकली टू एडवांस इन टू सम मोर पार्ट ऑफ कर्नाटका रायल सीमा एंड कोस्टल आंध्र प्रदेश एंड ऑल्सो पार्ट ऑफ बे बंगाल एंड अरेबियन सी ड्यूरिंग नेक्स्ट टू टू थ्री डेज इफ यू टॉक अबाउट द ऑब्जर्व वेदर सो द मेन ऑब्जर्व वेदर वॉज द हीट वेव कंडीशन ओवर नॉर्थ वेस्ट इंडिया एंड सेंट्रल एंड ईस्ट इंडिया but if we compare it with the heat wave conditions which were being observed 2 uh, 3 days ago then compared to that it is very uh, uh, very small in intensity as well as in distribution over uh, punjab and haryana only 3 to 4 stations uh, at both subdivisions have been observed in heat wave and over west rajasthan only one station of ganganagar has observed heat wave conditions and over uh, west up only one station of jhansi has reported heat wave conditions and over west mp only northwest mp gwalior has reported heat wave conditions but over uh, east mp or northern parts of east mp five six stations have reported uh, heat wave conditions and uh, uh, three four stations have reported heat wave conditions over uh, uh, central parts of uh, vidarbha and also central parts of chatisgarh had has reported uh, uh, three four stations heat wave conditions and over daltonganj of jharkhand over the western parts of jharkhand heat wave conditions have been reported and similarly over uh, three four stations of uh, odisha heat wave conditions has been reported and no severe heat wave conditions have been reported over the entire country so that shows that how the temperatures which were going up to 49 degree centigrade have fallen significantly and uh, only some stations uh, uh, have been uh, there above 45 degree over the areas which have been uh, seen here and so this heat wave conditions which has reduced in intensity as well as in distribution is likely to continue during next 3 uh, days over these regions as we can see over here that the heat wave conditions are likely to continue over punjab haryana uh, delhi and west up and also parts of north mp and also parts of uh, western parts of jharkhand vidarbha chatisgarh and odisha during next 3 uh, uh, days and the due to the higher temperatures and also the uh, humid conditions being observed currently over the punjab and haryana and west up the orange color for the heat wave conditions of uh, warning is being maintained till uh, uh, 3rd of june and thereafter only only yellow color is being uh, given for this heat wave conditions all over odisha Uh, for next 4 days uh, heat wave conditions with orange color is being given although this uh, the heat wave conditions would be uh, primarily observed in northern parts of odisha only Uh, so that was all about the heat wave conditions and uh, uh, then if we come over to the rainfall activity so currently if we see the, there is a, there are cyclonic circulations over northwest india over uh, over north haryana neighborhood uh, over uh, southwest up and neighborhood another cy- uh, cyclonic circulation is there over southwest rajasthan and and uh, southwesterly winds are prevailing over the uh, over the plains of northwest india especially over over rajasthan which are which have uh, in fact uh, uh, become the most uh, responsible factor for uh, bringing down the maximum temperatures over these regions so uh, over rajasthan also the northwest rajasthan the ganganagar area may continue to receive uh, uh, heat wave conditions during next two days and this these uh, southwesterly winds from arabian sea are likely to continue over the plains of northwest india uh, during next 5 uh, to 7 days and uh, we are expecting a western disturbance from 4th of june and this western disturbance along with this these uh, southwesterly winds from arabian sea are going to cause isolated uh, rainfall activity over uh, rajasthan over punjab haryana delhi and west up uh, during uh, 4th june to 7th of june along with the, the thunderstorm activity as well as the uh, gusty winds may also be there of the order of 30 to 40 kmph uh, over this region of punjab haryana west uh, uh, west up and uh, northern parts of rajasthan during 4th to 7th of uh, uh, 4th to 7th of uh, june and that's why the heat wave 
conditions over these areas are being reduced are being in fact abated from uh, from 7th of uh, from uh, uh, 5th of june so uh, that was about heat wave condition and an approaching western disturbance over northwest india from 4th of june now if we talk about the uh, southwest monsoon so southwest monsoon has today uh, further advanced into some uh, more parts of uh, central arabian sea and also uh, it has covered some parts of karnataka as well as it has uh, entered into andhra pradesh so the northern limit of southwest monsoon is today passing across the central arabian sea and then it is going to uh, Mangalore of uh, uh, coastal Karnataka and from there it is going to uh, Chitradurga of South India Karnataka and from there it is going to Nellore of coastal Andhra Pradesh and from there through the Bay of Bengal it is going uh, to the sub Himalayan West Bengal. So uh, this is uh, today's uh, situation and for next two to three days this uh, southwest monsoon is likely to cover some more parts of uh, Karnataka and some more parts of Rayal Sima and uh, coastal Andhra Pradesh and obviously it will further also cover uh, some more parts of uh, Central Arabian Sea as well as uh, some more parts of West Central Bay of Bengal and Northwest Bay of Bengal. So uh, that was about the monsoon, the approaching western disturbance and the and the uh, uh, heat wave conditions and uh, as far as uh, the heavy rainfall warning is concerned so only uh, heavy heavy rainfall activity is likely to continue in next three days over Assam and Meghalaya and over Tripura and Mizoram during next uh, three days with the probability of very heavy rainfall also over Meghalaya during next uh, three days and also over uh, Kerala isolated heavy rainfall activity is likely to continue during next uh, uh, five days with the possibility of very heavy rainfall today and heavy rainfall activity uh, uh, thereafter for next uh, for subsequent four days and isolated heavy rainfall Today is also likely over uh, South India Karnataka and coastal Karnataka and over Tamil Nadu and uh, thereafter uh, the, this uh, South India Karnataka and North India Karnataka are likely to continue to receive light to moderate rainfall uh, at uh, uh, many places with isolated heavy rainfall during subsequent four days. So that's all for today. Tomorrow we will again meet with Delhi weather briefing for weather warning during next five days. Thank you and goodbye.